This local sports report is presented by Devin Young, a local realtor with Century 21 Heritage House and a proud supporter of the Woodstock Navy Vets. Devin specializes in residential sales in Oxford County and the surrounding communities. Contact Devin today if you're buying or selling. Call direct at 519-532-2210 or email devin.young at Century 21. It's fan appreciation night in Woodstock for the Navy Vets' final game of the regular season. The Vets will face the Paris Titans in the first round of the playoffs. Meanwhile, the Tavistock Braves will battle the Hespler Shamrocks in the Doherty quarterfinals. Opening period on Friday, it's a great start for Woodstock. This is Nolan Brett with a lead pass for Sam Barry. Here comes the captain and he scores. Barry giving Woodstock the early lead. It's 1-0 and the Vets get another one three minutes later. The puck goes to Ethan Zabo. He rips. Rips it and scores. Zabo with his 14th goal of the year. Woodstock with a two goal advantage. Still in the first more vets offense. Nolan Brett takes the feed. And how about this shot? Brett wires it top shelf. That's his 29th of the year. It's 3 0 Woodstock midway through the period. And that prompts a timeout for the Braves. They're trying to regroup, trailing by three. Later in the first, it's a terrific stop from James Hopper. He robs Tyler Smeet on the doorstep. Huge from Hopper as he keeps it a three goal game after 20 minutes. Second period now more for the Braves goaltender. This is outstanding as Hopper reaches across and stones Tate McKenna. Here's a good look at the save on the replay. Still 3-0 for the Vets as we move to the third. Nolan Burnside intercepts the pass. He gives it to Ethan Zabo who buries another one. Zabo with his second goal of the night. Woodstock is up 4-0 and that was the final. Scott Rodriguez making 30 saves to post a shutout. Here are the Woodstock players talking about their first round matchup against the Paris Titans. I think it's going to be fast, definitely a lot of contact. They, they can move. They have a few guys that are really quick, and they're going to chip it by us and just go. It's going to be a tough, hard series, so I don't think there's anything easy about that series. It's going to be a tough series. Um, uh, they always come out hard. They come out gritty, and uh, yeah, it, they, every game they're, they're coming out and they're, they're, they're putting up a fight, and I think we just got to make sure we come ready to go every night, and uh, hopefully we can we can uh, come out of that series uh, on top.